Hey guys, this video will show you what happens if you choose to help the mages or the templars when you get to this part of the main quest. So if you choose to help the templars, the mages won't help you for the rest of the game, as it says, and vice versa if you help the mages, the templars won't help you. If you choose to help the mages, you will get Durian, a male human mage, to help you. And if you choose the templars, you will get Cole, who's also a male and he's a rogue with uh, dual blades. So they're both cool missions and they both have to do with red lyrium and a high power. So enjoy and thanks for watching. Announce us. The Magister's invitation was for Mistress Lavellan and no one else. You lot wait here. Where I go, they go. My Lord Magister, the agents of the Inquisition have arrived. My friend, it's so good to see you again. And your associates, of course. I'm sure we can work out some arrangement that is equitable to all parties. Are we mages to have no voice in deciding our fate? Fiona, you would not have turned your followers over to my care if you did not trust me with their lives. Enough pleasantries. Shall we begin? It's refreshing to meet someone so goal-oriented. The Inquisition needs mages to close the breach, and I have them. So, what shall you offer in exchange? Nothing at all. I'm just going to take the mages and leave. And how do you imagine you'll accomplish such a feat? She knows everything, father. Felix, what have you done? You wanted me here. Why? Do you know what you are? You walk into my stronghold with your stolen mark, a gift you don't even understand, and think you're in control. You're nothing but a mistake. If you know so much, enlighten me. Tell me what this mark on my hand is for. It belongs to your betters. You wouldn't even begin to understand its purpose. Father, listen to yourself. Do you know what you sound like? He sounds exactly like the sort of villainous cliché everyone expects us to be. Dorian. I gave you a chance to be a part of this. You turned me down. The Elder One has power you would not believe. He will raise the Imperium from its own ashes. What's better than turning back time? He will make the world bow to mages once more. We will rule from the Boric Ocean to the frozen seas. You can't involve my people in this. Alexius, this is exactly what you and I talked about never wanting to happen. Why would you support this? Stop it, Father. Give up the Venatori. Let the Southern Mages fight the Breach, and let's go home. No. It's the only way, Felix. He can save you. Save me? There is a way. The Elder One promised, if I undo the mistake at the Temple... I'm going to die. You need to accept that. Seize them, Venatori. The Elder One demands this woman's life. Your men are dead, Alexius. You are a mistake. You should never have existed. No! It's 
probably not what Alexius intended. The rift must have moved us to what? The closest confluence of arcane energy. The last thing I remember, we were in the castle hall. Let's see. If we're still in the castle, it isn't. Oh, of course, it's not simply where, it's when. Alexius used the amulet as a focus. It moved us through time. Did we go forward in time or back, and how far? Those are excellent questions. We'll have to find out, won't we? Let's look around, see where the rift took us. Then we can figure out how to get back. If we can. What was Alexius trying to do? I believe his original plan was to remove you from time completely. If that happened, you would never have been at the Temple of Sacred Ashes or mangled his Elder One's plan. I think your surprise in the castle hall made him reckless. He tossed us into the rift before he was ready. I counted it. The magic went wild, and here we are. Makes sense? It just seems so insane. I don't even want to think about what this will do to the fabric of the world. We didn't travel through time so much as punch a hole through it and toss it into the privy. But don't worry. I'm here. I'll protect you. There were others in the hall. Could they have been drawn through the rift? I doubt it was large enough to bring the whole room through. Alexius wouldn't risk catching himself or Felix in it. They're probably still where and when we left them. In some sense, anyway. Alexius mentioned an elder one in the hall. Do you know who he was talking about? Leader of the Venatori, I suspect. Some magister aspiring to godhood. It's the same old tune. Let's play with magic we don't understand. It will make us incredibly powerful. Evidently, it doesn't matter if you rip apart the fabric of time in the process. You have a plan to get us back, I hope. I have some thoughts on that. They're lovely thoughts, like little jewels. Look at what you've done, Alexius. All this suffering. And for what? For my country, for my son. But it means nothing now. I knew you would appear again. Not that it would be now. But I knew I hadn't destroyed you. My final failure. Was it worth it? Everything you did to the world, to yourself. It doesn't matter now. All we can do is wait for the end. It does matter. I will undo this. How many times have I tried? The past cannot be undone. All that I fought for, all that I betrayed, and what have I wrought? Ruin and death, there is nothing else. The Elder One comes for me, for you, for us all. <sighs> Felix. That's Felix. Make his breath, Alexius. What have you done? He would have died, Dorian. I saved him. Please, don't hurt my son. I'll do anything you ask. Hand over the amulet and we let him go. Let him go and I swear you get what you want. I want the world back. <laughs> no. No! He wanted to die, didn't he? All those lies he told himself, the justifications. He lost Felix long ago. He didn't even notice. Oh, Alexius. I know you cared for him. Once he was a man to whom I compared all others. Sad, isn't it? This is the same amulet he used before. I think it's the same one we made in Minrathus. That's a relief. Give me an hour to work out the spell he used, and I should be able to reopen the rift. An hour? That's impossible! You must go now! The Elder One. Alexius was the puppet. 
This is his master. We'll head out front. Keep them off your tail. No, I won't let you commit suicide. Look at us. We're already dead. The only way we live is if this day never comes. Cast your spell. You have as much time as I have hours. Though darkness closes, I am shielded by flame. Andraste, guide me. Maker, take me to your side. You move, and we all die! <laughs> You'll have to do better than that. You failed, Alexius. How forgiving is your Elder One? You won. There is no point extending this charade, Elix. It's going to be all right, Father. You'll die. Everyone dies. Well, I'm glad that's over with. Grand Enchanter, imagine how surprised I was to learn you'd given Redcliffe Castle away to a Tevinter Magister. King Alistair. Especially since I'm fairly sure Redcliffe belongs to Arl Tegan. Your Majesty, we never intended... I know what you intended. I wanted to help you. But you've made it impossible. You and your followers are no longer welcome in Ferelden. But we have hundreds who need protection. Where will we go? I should point out that we did come here for mages to close the breach. And what are the terms of this arrangement? Hopefully better than what Alexius gave you. The Inquisition is better than that, yes? We need their skills, but they have proven themselves far from trustworthy. It seems we have little choice but to accept whatever you offer. We would be honored to have you fight as allies at the Inquisition's side. A generous offer. But will the rest of the Inquisition honor it? The Breach threatens all of Thedas. We cannot afford to be divided now. We can't fight it without you. Any chance of success requires your full support. I'd take that offer if I were you. One way or another, you're leaving my kingdom. We accept. It would be madness not to. I will gather my people and ready them for the journey to Haven. The breach will be closed. You will not regret giving us this chance. It's not a matter for debate. There will be abominations among the mages, and we must be prepared. If we rescind the offer of an alliance, it makes the Inquisition appear incompetent at best, tyrannical at worst. 
What were you thinking? Turning mages loose with no oversight. The veil is torn open. We need them to close the breach. It's not going to work if we make enemies of them. I know we need them for the breach, but they could do as much damage as the demons themselves. Enough arguing. None of us were there. We cannot afford to second-guess our people. The sole point of the Herald's mission was to gain the mage's aid, and that was accomplished. The voice of pragmatism speaks. And here I was, just starting to enjoy the circular arguments. Closing the breach is all that matters. The longer the breach is open, the more damage it does. We should head there as soon as possible. Agreed. We should look into the things you saw in this dark future. The assassination of Empress Selene. A demon army. Sounds like something a Tevinta cult might do. Orle falls, the Imperium rises. Chaos for everyone. One battle at a time. It's going to take time to organize our troops and the mage recruits. Let's take this to the war room. Join us. None of this means anything without your mark, after all. Thank you. I'd be honored to help with the plan. Meet us there when you're ready. I'll skip the War Council, but I would like to see this breach up close, if you don't mind. Then you're staying? Oh, didn't I mention? The South is so charming and rustic. I adore it to little pieces. I must admit I'm surprised. We both saw what could happen. What this Elder One and his cult are trying to do. Not everything from Tevinter is terrible. Some of us have fought for eons against this sort of madness. It's my duty to stand with you. That future will not come to pass. There's no one I'd rather be stranded in time with. Future or present. Excellent choice. But let's not get stranded again anytime soon, yes? I'll begin preparations to march on the summit. Make a willing, the mages will be enough to grant us victory. The Lord Seeker had a plan, but the Herald ruined it by arriving with purpose. It sowed too much dissent. Night Captain, I must know what's going on. You are all supposed to be changed. Now we must purge the questioning knights. For once, I agree with them. The Elder One is coming. No one will leave fair and far to his own state and red. Make us breath. Wait. Envy is hurting you. Mirrors on mirrors on memories. A face it can feel but not fake. I want to help you, not Envy. I'm through with your lies, Envy. I'm not a lie. I'm Cole. We're inside you. Well, I am. You're always inside you. It's easy to hear, harder to be a part of what you're hearing. But I'm here, hearing, helping, I hope. Envy hurt you, is hurting you. I tried to help, then I was here, in the hearing. It's, it's not usually like this. If you can explain this, I'm listening. I was watching. I watch. Every Templar knew when you arrived. They were impressed, but not like the Lord Seeker. The Lord Seeker is an envy demon. It wants to be me. Yes. It twisted the commanders, forced their fury, their fight. They're red inside. Anyway, you're frozen. Envy is trying to take your face. I heard it and reached out. And then in. And then I was here. Let 
Nothing you say is helping to clear my head. It's your head. I hoped you'd know how to stop it. Well, I don't. All of this is envy. People, places, power. If you keep going, envy stretches. It takes strength to make more. Being one person is hard. Being many, too many, more and more, and envy breaks down. You break out. So, if we keep moving in my head, we tire envy into submission? Maybe. I hope it helps. It's more than sitting here waiting to lose your face. Make yourself alive. I used to be like you. I'm not anymore. You shouldn't be either. Herald, Knight Templar Fletcher. Before he died, Sir Barris described how you revealed the demon with Andraste's holy light. We lacked vigilance. Our officers failed us. The rest of the Order was blind. If the Inquisition has use for us, we're ready to hear it. There was corruption here, but also I see valor and honor in each of you who stood fast. Rise tall again. Help the Inquisition seal the breach before it swallows us all. We shirked our purpose because we were afraid to question. I see that now. But our order is without officers. We must rebuild what the traitors tore down. Your order is a symbol that holds the people's respect. That cannot die today. We offer you an alliance. Supplies, weapons, grounds to shelter you. All we ask is you help us close the breach. Templars, do we ally with the Inquisition? This partnership will be celebrated across Thedas. I hope the Inquisition's stronghold is ready. I oh, don't worry. I think we're expecting company. Officers betraying their soldiers, Templars without leaders, a demon imitating the Lord Seeker. We should have taken them to task, the crimes they've committed were committed by their officers. The soldiers of the Order will serve. These crimes put them at our mercy, yet the terms of this alliance do not benefit the Inquisition as they should. You should have consulted us, Herald. It was chaos. I couldn't keep the Templars in the courtyard while I searched for a messenger bird. An alliance with the Templars was our desired outcome. May we discuss their imminent arrival? A few dozen veterans are coming ahead of the rest, to help seal the breach. How soon until these veterans arrive? They're almost here. Templars don't like to be late. Make... Wait! I came with you to help. I would have told you before, but you were busy. 
You were following behind me in secret, Cole. All the way to Haven. Yes. It's easy to make people forget you when they don't expect you to be there. Call the guards. This creature is not what you... A moment, please, Cassandra. I would like to hear why he came. You help people. You made them safe when they would have died. I want to do that. I can help. Why and how would you help the Inquisition? The hole in the sky is too loud for spirits to think. It's pulling, pushing out pain. I want to stop it. How altruistic of you. I want to help. I can be hard to see. I can kill things that would hurt people. I won't get in the way. Cole saved my life in Theronfall. I couldn't have defeated Envy without him. But what does he want now? I think he really is trying to help. I won't be in the way. Tiny, no trouble. No notice taken unless you want them to. You're not honestly suggesting we give him run of the camp? Not freely, perhaps. But it seems a waste to... Hold on. Where did he go? It's a good trick. You get used to it. We must see if he can teach it to anyone else. I'll have people watch the boy. But let's not be distracted from the breach. We'll need your help when the Templar veterans arrive. Take time to prepare while you can. 